Verma here. Welcome back to my channel. As you all know that I am a student of Harvard University Neuroscience course and I am having online classes due to this coronavirus pandemic right now. The classes are growing amazing actually but yeah, you know that online and then offline there is a major difference. Anyways, so I want to tell you all that I actually registered for Oxbridge campus classes also for biology and chemistry. And Oxbridge is basically Oxford plus Cambridge University in United Kingdom. So I would be perhaps attending those. I haven't checked my email right now and I will check in front of you. But I applied, I gave my application there, I submitted every detail and right now fingers are crossed because Let's check the result if I'm selected or not, okay? Finally, I'm checking the email. I believe I can fly. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oxford University. Okay, Oxford University joining instructions and past papers. Bio and chemistry, okay. So they sent me an email that says, Congratulations, I am pleased to say you have a place confirmed as per your enrollment choice, either biology or chemistry or both, for the Oxford University classes. I'm selected. Okay. Our places are usually very competitive and we only have a limited number of seats open for new external students. We will be sending you full joining instructions. That is how to join the session as well as pass paper questions to you and these will be asked for your subject choice. Okay. So as I can see that they actually sent me a few pass papers as well to solve before the classes and um, wow. <laughs> okay, so as they have sent me these pass papers etc. I'll try to solve it right now. They have mentioned that it's not required to do all the questions, but before the classes actually start of Oxford Universities, which is basically given by doctors, like they are going to teach us the pre-medical students, like how are you going to uh, prepare for biology and chemistry as well. And they're going to give some classes uh, from the university. So they want us to actually practice few past paper questions. So we have some prerequisite knowledge and uh, Let's see how it goes. I'll just take a printout of it right now. See ya! Hey guys, so I'm finally back. I just informed my parents that I am gonna go for the Oxford classes. They are very, very excited and they are happy. They are basically like, wow. <laughs> so now I have taken out the printout of the questions they have given me. They are basically like around 26 pages each of biology and chemistry like we had the option to get like bio classes or chemistry and I took both like biology and chemistry both. So now I have questions of biology and chemistry. Wow. Can you identify this diagram? It's chloroplast. <laughs> okay. So I actually have a lot of questions here. I would be solving a few today because I'm very tired of the Harvard University plus I have some USS Science Festival also coming up of NASA and I have a lot of homework and exams of Harvard University as well to do. Schedule is busy. I guess the questions of India and um, Oxbridge campus is kind of like same because I feel that I can solve them easily. So now they are gonna discuss it. I mean, it's like just exam papers or something because they are gonna discuss with us. So let's start. So guys, before starting, I just want to tell that uh, my working environment is kind of like usually changing. It's not fixed. Sometimes I study at my library, sometimes abroad, like 
I travel between countries and then I'm gonna study in the airplane or whatever you must have seen in my pictures on Instagram or so. If you haven't followed me on Instagram, just follow sans underscore karma. It would be in the description or the comment section. I have chosen this working environment today because I have some chemistry papers to solve as well and I have my periodic table of elements in front of me. So I can usually just like take a look or something. But uh, we are required in India at least to like remember the periodic table because we are not provided any kind of like um, elements or so in the exam. I have a few things from different countries, London, USA, kind of like OW for positivity or so. Then I have my laptop, I have my papers, pen, stationery and uh, I have my foot massager going on below that you cannot see because it's stable there with a switch under this table. <laughs> so I keep massaging my foot, I'm so lazy, right? And then I have my air conditioner going on and my air purifier because right now the condition here of air as well as of dander season is very very bad. So I just want to like uh, have the pure air for me. Okay, so I'm gonna start my video. I'm gonna go for a time lapse one, I guess, and then we'll start discussing. Okay guys, so I'm halfway completed through my chemistry and biology video and it's almost midnight right now. I have my Harvard classes tomorrow morning, so I think I should sleep and uh, yeah, I'm almost done. There are so many questions. So, we'll see you later. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please do not forget to like, comment, share, subscribe my channel. Love you all. Bye!